hi guys i am suraj and in this video i am going to show you how to make vijay title card in the movie master and to make it you need adobe after effects vlc media player and a plugin called element 3d which is used in adobe after effects and you can download that plugin using any web browser so let's get started I have provided a link in the description box to download the project files and after you click that it will redirect to a website like this and after some seconds it will pop up a skip pad option and now you can see the download page and this file is in the form of RAR and you need WinRAR in order to open this file and by clicking the download option you, your download will be started. So after downloading it, uh, you can open this file. Okay, so you open this folder and again you open the master folder. And from here, uh, you can see uh, footage and uh, master AEP. And this is the After Effects uh, project. Uh, and uh, from here, you can see uh, two videos and uh, these two files. So uh, you need to copy this to your desktop and you also need to copy this uh, master uh, after effects project also now open the after effects project as i opened it shows like this so to remove it go to this section and right click here and click the import option click the multiple files And now select the two videos which we have copied to the desktop right now. Now drag those two and click the import button here. Now the two videos have been added here. I'll just close it. And then uh, from this from this section, you can see the particle. 4 and it's a uh, hashtag number is 6 so just note that number and uh, delete that particle 4 which is at number 6 and uh, we need to uh, replace the particle 4 with the new one which we have imported right now and i'm clicking the particle 4 and just left click and just drag it drag it to number 6 Okay, now resize it. Yeah, and uh, you can see this option, which is the expander collapse the transfer controls again. Click it, and you can see uh, the opacity mode. And from that, in the particles four, click the normal, and from that, you need to select the screen option. Okay. And like like this, uh, we also need to replace the particle 11 video. So again, click the particle 11, which is at the hashtag number 12, and delete it. Just using the delete key option. And from the uh, this section, click the particle 11 and just drag it to the hash 12. And again, you need to resize it. In and change the mode to screen so now the error has been removed and the only thing left is to just change the name so just now go to this text option click that and uh, i'm just going to type the name which i want in this video um, I'm going to type random. And then you need to go to this E3D. The second E3D, not the first one. Just go to the second E3D, click it, 
then click this option to expand the options and again click effects from that I click the element and uh, by dragging down you can see the option custom layer click it click uh, custom text and masks and from that you can see a uh, path layer one click this one and now change it to random now the text will change to random yes so the thumbnail text has been changed to random so now we can just remove the text we have typed here just go to this text and you can see the i option like this just click it so the text has been removed now so we also need to change this also so in order to do that i'm again entering a text my name is so much okay so then again you have to uh, do like this go to e3d at the first first one first e3d not the second one put first e3d and uh, expand it expand the effects and from that expand the element go down put to the custom layers custom text and masks from there the path layer one change this to the name in which you want to change so talabadi vijay has changed to suraj so work is done and the only thing left is now to uh, remove this text so go to the name text behavior which i have typed and just click this option okay so now clip is uh, ready but we need to save it so to save it we go to the composition option here from that you can see a pre-render option and click it let's click this custom avi and uh, just go to this and click this import the format will be uh, avi itself and click ok and click this output to you can change the name of this file and uh, i am now uh, saving this file to desktop and just uh, click save and click the render option so the video will be saved in the format uh, avi not mp4 so in order to convert it into mp4 um, we need elc media player now click the media from that click convert or save option and now click the add button and select the video now click the down arrow and click convert now click the browse button and click the save option then click the start option our video has now finished recording i hope all of you enjoyed this video and if you enjoyed please like comment and share with your friends and don't forget to subscribe my channel for more videos thank you